Hey guys, we made it back over to the uh, pilings we set this past week uh, to go ahead and get the uh, top put on. We're going to install a hip style roof and install a 16,000 pound lift in this uh, boathouse. So we're getting scaffolding up right now. Get it where we can walk around it. Then we're going to go ahead and get started on the boathouse roof. And then uh, get the lift installed. Y'all stay tuned. We'll go ahead and do a couple progress pictures or videos of this as we go along. If y'all haven't subscribed yet, hit subscribe. I think this stuff's pretty interesting. And if you would, hit like and share. And if you got any comments, uh, please feel free to leave me some comments. If you got any questions, I'll be happy to try and get back with you. Thanks. We got Tim McGraw working for us now. You look A lot of work goes into getting the pilings ready for the boathouse roof. We got to get them notched, all cut off level, squared up. Also get all the scaffolding set up in a safe manner so we can walk around the boathouse.
We've got the lift installed. It's a 16,000 pound golden boat lift, C drive. We've got the electrician coming over tomorrow to get the electrical work done, get the boat on a lift and get everything lined up just perfectly for this boat. Another beautiful boathouse built by Dale's Marine. Hey, we got this project finished up. Got the Grady White sitting in there. We got a little bit of adjustments to do on the lift to get it centered up properly, but uh, everything turned out real good. The lift works good. It's a 16,000 pound Golden Sea Drive boat lift. If you guys haven't subscribed to my channel, if you would, please subscribe, like, and share. If you got a comment or question, let me know, and I'll try to get back with you. It's amazing. We're rapidly approaching a thousand subscribers. Just started off with a few, but uh, I guess what we do is pretty interesting to most people. We like to leave the uh, rafters open in the middle so you can lift that boat with the radar towers and everything just as high as possible in the boathouse. Right, we got this boathouse project completed, wrapped up, shingles on it, barge is pulling out, we're headed to the next project. We've got a uh, vinyl seawall that is uh, moored a large boat right in front of it, and it's scoured out underneath the seawall. So we're going to go back with some 20-foot sheets, drive the sheets in, try to keep the dirt from being washed out on the backside of the wall, and give them a safe place to moor his boat.